I have done that, and guys have come up to me as well, yeah. Oh, so, cool. so I want to meet them in person out doing something nice, like at a bar or a gig or something like that. I'm Arno from France, and in today's video, I'm going to ask British girl what it's like to date in the UK. What's their ideal guy? You know, which guy they are going for in terms of like personality, maybe looks. Pretty excited, and let's do it, guys. All right, come on. Perfect. So, what's your name first? Kennedy. Kennedy. Wow, that's lovely. So the question is, what would be your ideal guy? Could you describe a little bit? Like what they look like? Yeah, or? what they look like, their personality, uh, what's their features, you know? So I think for me, like looks isn't necessarily the first thing that okay, I'd yeah. go for. Um, it's got to be someone that's selfish or but not mm. arrogant, pretty humble, um, nice, has yeah. the same interest as me, interesting. I'm into the environment, things like that. So awesome. yeah, somebody that's got the same sort of values as me. Awesome. Yeah, but if I had to pick someone with looks, I like long hair. Long yeah, hair. yeah. Right. I like earrings as well. Yeah. Like, yeah. That. <laughs> yeah cool. Thanks. All yeah. Right. <laughs> The next question would be like, um, how to meet someone in the UK? Like what's the, the most common way to meet someone in the UK? It's like through dating apps, at work, through friends? Well, I've just graduated from uni, so I feel like at uni oh. is a really easy time to meet yeah. someone. Now that I'm finishing uni, I'm like, how do you meet mm. people? Um, but yeah, yeah, at uni, I've never used a dating app, but I think that's a popular thing yeah. now, so... I think it is, I think it is. I don't know. I, just, it's, it's, uh, I feel like dating out, I don't know if it's to meet partners, but if you want to like sleep with them, I feel like mm. for people that I know, that's a yeah. big thing. So maybe that's how you meet someone if you... All right. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. For me, I like traditional. I want to meet them in person out doing something nice, like at a bar or a gig or something like that. So you're the type of girl that asks the guy, or a guy asks you? Oh, uh, I'd like it to be equal, but I think I'd like the guy to ask me. But I, I would, I would ask a guy too. Yeah. All right. Pretty cool. <laughs> pretty cool. And last question. Any advice to the people watching on how to get like a British girl? There is like some something specific. Um. Not too much arrogance, that's what I oh, think. I anyway, nice and calm and collected. And we don't like to be wolf whistled at, cat called, just <laughs> nice. <laughs> just nice, approachable, friendly. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> that's awesome, bro. Really nice to meet you. Perfect. So, what's your name? Katie. Katie, nice to meet you. So, the question is like, what's your ideal guy? Can you describe a little bit? Um, what would be your ideal guy? My ideal guy, probably someone funny, kind. Yeah. And a little bit quirky. A little bit quirky? Quirky, yeah. Just someone who's going to make me laugh, really. All right. And someone who's uh, got a good family base. Mm. Yeah. And you, you prefer like, to date a guy that is outgoing, friendly, or maybe more like a guy that is a little bit shy and more reserved? Uh, more outgoing, definitely. All yeah. right. Pretty interesting. And for you, what's the best way to meet like someone in the UK? Um, you prefer to date someone like through like uh, meet someone through like a dating app at work or no not dating apps um yeah they're just made to hook up really aren't they <laughs> not not like proper dating but like yeah real dating i'd go out in the street and just see who you meet really i think all right or events where you like music events or art events mm. if you both like something and you'll find someone who likes the same things pretty cool yeah so you're the type of girl that you know you are going in the street and you're asking guys I have guys done, come up I to go. Done, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have done that, and guys have come up to me as well. Yeah. Oh, so, that's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty nice. It's a lot better than internet crap. Any advice for people watching how to like get a British girl? Um, I would say if you like someone, just just pop the question. Just say like, I like you. I like the look of you. Do you want to get to know each other? And what's the worst they're gonna say is no. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. And then you just go home and you think, oh well find someone else yeah yeah awesome <laughs> so what's your ideal guy could you describe a little bit probably my boyfriend oh right. <laughs> can you like elaborate a little bit what's the feature he has uh, he's really clever and creative all right and do you mean physical yeah physical also like you know personality as well a okay, bit of both yeah. you know so also he's quite um dark 
Um, tall, okay. handsome. <laughs> he has a big nose. I like big noses. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> he's Italian, so yeah, he's ticking all the boxes for me. Oh, that's pretty good. And to your opinion, what's the best way to meet someone in the UK? Through like dating apps, or like at work, or like through some friends? What's the best way, or like the most common way to meet uh, a partner in the UK? Mm, I mean, I think organically is always best, but it's really hard nowadays to meet yeah. people just in bars and clubs and things. So mm. the apps are okay. Um, you know, Tinder is yeah. not the best one. Probably go for a more niche one. Cause What's your favorite about Tinder, by the way? I think it's just too many people on yeah. Tinder, so that's why, you know, it's maybe harder to find someone serious. Yeah. It's more like a hookup app. Yeah. Um, but yeah, there are other apps that I think are mm. more probably suitable for different kind of people. Any advice, by the way? Uh, Any advice? <laughs> which, which app would be better? Uh, Happen is quite good. All Happen. Right. That's a fr Are you French? Yeah. That's a French app. Um, oh, it is? I didn't yeah. even know. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. a French app. Happen's quite good. Bumble, Hinge. Um, there's one called Inner Circle, which is like a really elitist one, but oh. a couple of my friends had some luck. Right, some success with that one but you have, it's like they don't let everyone join and, oh, and some like special feature of criteria you have to tick some boxes exactly yeah but mm. i think obviously meeting someone naturally at uni at mm. work that's the best way awesome and how did you meet your boyfriend by the way what was the way for you we met on an app oh, no? <laughs> yeah oh. so it's not the most romantic we met on happen actually right. yeah All so right. happen is the one for me anyway it was it was quite successful All right but you know romantically the idea is you just meet you know in the supermarket yeah. or something <laughs> but that doesn't yeah. happen so much pretty cool and what's, what's your name celeste celeste yes that's a french name yeah it's a british name yeah. as well but it's also french beautiful, yeah beautiful name perfect. thank you thank you thanks for the interaction <laughs> my name's kate kate perfect so the question is, what's your ideal guy? Could you like describe a little bit your the feature, maybe personality-wise? Yeah, I mean, if I don't describe my boyfriend, I'm probably in yeah, trouble. Go, go for your boyfriend. Go but, for uh, him. I don't know. Somebody's funny. I'm Irish, so if uh, oh, you're Irish. Yeah, you can make me laugh. I'm all right then. Yeah, all right. that would be fairly it. You would prefer to date someone that is more maybe outgoing, friendly, or maybe like more reserved and, and shy. What's your you take? Yeah, I mean, it just depends on the person, I think, to be fair. I mean, I'm quite an outgoing person, so, mm -hmm. I mean, if there's too too much outgoingness in the room, I probably get quite loud, but um, oh. as long as there's a balance in a relationship, I think that's probably how it works. All right. And what's the best way to meet people in the UK? How does it work exactly? Like, people use dating apps or they meet at work or, like, through friends? Yeah, like I met my partner through friends, which is probably quite an old-fashioned way to do it now these days. Uh -huh. But um, I mean, like apps are still quite big. I know Thursday's gotten quite big recently as well. Um, obviously, like Hinge and Tinder, I believe Tinder's having a bit of a resurgence yeah. at the moment. But um, I mean, after the pandemic, everyone just wants to get out. Everyone wants to meet people now. So um, yeah, hopefully the traditional ways are still there because I think that's important. Yeah. So, yeah. Pretty you cool. Yeah, right. pretty cool. Thank you very much. Cool. Yeah, Thanks, have a good one. Yeah, see you. See you. All right, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video comment down below any reaction uh, if you want me to ask a special question go for it and i'll see you in the next one all right see you guys